very good evening logical reasoning so this type of question they usually ask in the examination but majority of the time it confuses the candidate so now we are going to see just by changing your thinking pattern how to succeed this type of question how to come out of colorful risks okay given below are two premises a and b and four conclusions are drawn from them select the code that states validly drawn conclusions taking the premises individually or jointly so there are two premises given and four conclusions given based on the two premises two conclusions are correct we need to find out the right combination of conclusions so these problems either can be operated by uh, venn diagram approach or you can go by a formula approach but i am going to teach you a very layman approach without any basics of logical reasoning you can clear just by altering your thinking pattern nothing else clear most of the dancers are physically fit this is the first information given when most of the dancers are physically fit then most of the physically fit are dancers is true am i right this is true correct when you say most of the dancers are physically fit then this number c is correct most of the physically fit persons are dancers okay first i found out this when most of the dancers are physically fit then most of the physically fit persons are dancers so prob uh, c is perfectly correct conclusion c perfectly follows the premises so options without c that that has to be ruled out so the answer is not a the answer is not b because it doesn't have the correct conclusion c now i need to check out whether it is b and c or c and d let me check out b most of the dancers are singers what is the premises most of the singers are dancers so there is a possibility most of the dancers are singers when you say most of the singers are dancers most of the dancers are singers that is also true so the answer is b and c hope it is clear thanks for watching stay tuned